So when you sit down to your Google TV, the easiest way to use it is to just look, search for what you're looking for. So I can select the search button, search for my favorite show, in this case, Friends, and Google TV returns a set of results telling me how I can access Friends. The first result is exactly what I'm looking for, Friends, the TV show. So I can select that, it'll change the channel for me on my TV, sh on my TV and start playing Friends. The, the next part of the product that I want to walk you through is, is just the, the cleaner interface. Um, you can select the home button and we'll take you to a, a range of options right here on the interface. So this dish logo is representing live TV. So if I select that and I get lost at any point, it'll just take me back to live TV. We want to make sure that users always know how they can get back to their cable box easily and quickly. So the next app on the home bar is our TV and movies application. So this is a search and discovery guide for all the TV shows and movies that I want to access. Um, and I can take you through this. So um, similar to when you push the guide button on your remote and you're taken to that grid style guide with the blue boxes and gray letters, uh, this is a way of showing you everything that you have access to on TV. Except for when we've kind of changed the paradigm a little bit. So a couple of things. Instead of organizing it by channel, channel 300, 301, 302, we've actually classified content as either a movie or a TV show. And instead of showing you, um, instead of showing you just a list of numerical channels. We've tried to we've we've tried to organize content by genre. So here, if I if I scroll down, these are all the TV shows I have access to, and here are all the comedy shows, drama, sports, news and talk, etc. Um, and and you can see one of the main organizing principles here is that we tell you, you we give you a picture of what you can actually um, of what the actual show is, and then I can select that show, and it'll take me straight there. Um, and change my TV channel. At any time, if I want to get back, I just press the home button, press my guide again, and I get taken back here to my um, TV and movies application where I can figure out what I want to watch. So if I were to do, if I were to actually search for a title, like let's say um, uh, we can search for Mission Impossible. We get a set of results. I can select Mission Impossible from 1996. It takes me to a, a movie's detail page. I can decide to rent it, and it tells me, look, I can get it on Dish or I can go to Amazon. If it was available through Netflix, so it'll, it would also show us. It would also show us Netflix. So um, the next application is, is Netflix. Um, so this is a Netflix application specifically optimized for Google TV, where you can access tens of thousands of um, movies and TV shows uh, through through Netflix. So here I have my instant queue of different um, movies I've put in there that I want to watch. Here are my recently watched films, you know, and 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 the rest of my the rest of their collection are available here as well. And then YouTube. So this is our YouTube Lean Back app. So it's an Android application specifically optimized for for Google TV. Um, and so what this allows me to do is I can easily search for for content. So I can search for so I can search for Lady Gaga and easily get a set of Lady Gaga results. Um, moving along the home bar, we have Market. So we launched Android Market in the fall. Um, and since then, we, we have about 150 apps specifically built for Google TV. Uh, there are also thousands of other apps uh, in here as well, and we'll continue to do work to um, increase the number of apps that our users have access to. So we've partnered with a lot of OEMs to come out with new devices this year that we're really excited about. Um, one of them is a set-top box that we you know, hope to hit the market at a, at a reasonable price point uh, so that all users can take advantage of, of Google TV. Uh, right now, y users can go buy a $99 uh, Logitech box, a Sony Blu-ray player, or an actual TV um, that has a Google software inside of the television set.